Hello and welcome back to Simply Solo Playthrough with the Chipmunk Gamer. And we're back here with Imperial Assault. This is the um, continuation, continuation of the campaign. Uh, this is episode 4, third campaign of Hoth. And I'm going to start and say right off the bat, I've had some technical difficulties. And one thing you'll notice is up in the screen right there, it's going to show Tuscan Raiders versus a hired gun. I had to, due to issues, I had to go back in and redo this. So, I actually have a clue where it's going now. It didn't finish well. But we're gonna try. We're gonna. We're back here, right back where we were. The only difference is it says Tuscan Raiders instead of hired guns. We're gonna continue with the hired guns, and it is um, our turn, and we're going to one, two, three, four. I would really like to get rid of him. Finn is going to blue and green his white. We do have a overcharger that we're going to exhaust. So that's out. Yay. One, two, three damage. Four accuracy. He's out of there. I know, it looks like I got some text to read. Deadly peril. The officer collapses to the floor. With his last ounce of strength, he taps a control on his device strapped to his wrist. Self destruct initiated. I feel like I need Major Barrett to say this. A computerized voice and tones over the Facilities calm system, calm, calm system. Detonation in four minutes. You aren't sure if this is a real threat or a ruse, but to be safe, you better finish taking out the research before the countdown expires. Continue. We're going to go on ahead and go after one of the hired guns. Blue, green versus a white. And we're going after the close one. Easily make accuracy. And we do two damage to number one. And that is the end of Finn's turn. Okay, we have, she needs to go after she's not going to move. She's going to go on ahead and shoot uh, with her military blaster, blue and yellow, against a black. And going after number one. Accuracy of two, easily made. One plus two is three damage. She will go on ahead and we're gonna try this one again. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we do have accuracy. Blocks two, and we only get a pierce one. So that's four. That's the end of her turn. Deadly peril. Self-destruct in three minutes. The computer voice and tones continue. Round 13. Oh, 
crab apple pies. Who, who, who do I go after first? Verna is going to go on ahead and go. Oh, she is no longer weakened. We're going to go after the same one. Okay, so that is... Accuracy is fine. We get a plus two. Minus, so we get one. One, two, three, four, five... She's going to have to shoot again. No. Okay, right? She has four endurance. She's going to take a strain to move one. And that was a five and one. Okay, so we get a pierce one. So that's going to hit. That takes care of this one. Because she's right next to him, she's going to go on ahead and take two strain to close quarter him. And she is going to one, two, three, four. And she gets a blue, yellow, and a green versus a black. Easily has accuracy at five. She does one damage. This is out. Sorry, that's out. So one damage plus one. So she gets um, accuracy plus two plus one. So she definitely has the accuracy. Oh, no, that's what she has to use. So that's one, two, three damage to number two. Good news. Okay, is, has, is in line of sight. And is going to go attack Verna. Oh, that's interesting. Plus two accuracy, plus one damage. Okay. Same, oddly enough. Okay, so easily has accuracy. Uh, plus one. So it's going to be one, two, three, four damage plus a weekend. Plus one damage, that's five. Minus two is three. Okay, he will then move four to attack Verna. One, two, three, four. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> Okay, we have to re-roll that, unfortunately. And that's out. So one, two, three, four damage. Wow. That racks up pretty darn quick. Okay, that is the end of the Assassin Droid's turn. Finn. She needs to move one, two. She just need, oh, can she strain? She can strain for one. Okay, so she will strain to move one. 
we'll go on ahead and uh, green and yellow versus black. And we have a plus one here. One, two, one, two, three. That is going to be, no. Okay. So one, two, plus a stun. And Vernon is going to have to attack. Um, not Vernon. Diala is going to have to attack again. Hoping to give her a rest. Oh, look at that. So one, two, three, plus one, and that's all we needed was one. And he is out. Or it is out, actually, I think would be far more accurate. Oh boy, they just wipe you out. Okay, that is Diala. Move to engage as many rebels as possible. Okay, so they went and they were going after Diala. Why Diala? I don't know. One, two, three. And we'll attack Diala, green and yellow versus a white. And Diala will take two damage. And then they move, what was it, four, one, two, three, Four and one, two, three, four. Right, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. And we'll attack Diala again. And Diala gets rid of that one. And they have a plus one, I guess we're going to have to use. Four for Diala. And he will again. Move back here. I hate those moves and repositions and everything. Okay, finish. How much does Havoc Shot cost? One? And they have four. Okay. I am going to one, two, three. One, two, yeah, three, yeah, three. There we go. That's right. Okay. So we're going to use, let's take a look. Yeah, we're going to command and Finn gets an interrupt. Oh, look at that. That's horrible. Ah, that's a complete mess. Okay. And Gideon is going to take a med pack and get rid of his strain. So he's resting. No. Oh, shoot. He's not going to. He's going to take the other strain and inspect this one. And he has a red, green. Oh, I am so fed up with this. Should have taken the rest. Okay. Okay. 
So we're going to go on ahead and we're going to take two shots at the hired guns. Four, that takes care of one of them. Boy, I wish I would have had the Havoc shot. That would have been nice. And we will shoot the other one. And he gets a dodge. Dang, Nabbit. Self-destruct in two minutes. Continue. Round 14. Finn is going to take out the other hired gun. Uh, we don't have a choice here. Because if he doesn't, they respawn the one. Easily have accuracy. Um, what do we get? We get a... Oh, I'm sorry. We'll use the overcharger, which gets rid of this. We don't have plasma cell on. It's, uh, let's see, we have a plus one. That's one, two, three. And they only have four, and they are out. Good job. Out. Done. Okay. And that ends his turn. Crumb, I wish he could have rested one. Okay. Diala has four endurance. She will strain one. She will interact with the door. Door open to wide room, place ten tile place the tiles. Okay. So we have our tiles. Continue. You think you catch motion out of the corner of your eye, and we get the regular assassin droids. Oh man, these guys are driving me batty. Can you? Destroying the shield general will set back Soren's efforts, but figuring out how to steal it would be even better. Continue. Okay, she can use reach and try to hit. Oh, I don't know what to do. We could use reach or we could use or rest. We're gonna rest. not going to take a med pack. Probably going to be a mistake. Okay. That is the end of Diala's turn. Assassin droids. Each one screw car performs the okay, health is healthiest. Okay, so they are not revealed. So they get a blue, a yellow, and a green. They go after the healthiest one out there. And that turns out to be... Thin. Gotta re roll it. It's completely off. Okay. So that's out. Plus one. So one, two, three to Finn. The other one is going to go after Diala. Come on, Diala. 
We need that. Not that. That is the exact opposite of what we needed. Two, three. Pierce doesn't work, weaken. That gives her seven. Finish. Okay, get in. One, two, one, two, three, too far. One, two, three, too far. Okay, she's gonna have to use reach then. He will command. No, he does not command. He is going to He is going to rest. And then order Diala to use reach to hit. And here's the interesting thing is info. Ignore focus fire and defensible abilities on this group's card. Uh, where'd the card go? Oh, there it is. Oh, defensible. Okay. So. She gets a. Oh, this is not going to work well. Green, yellow. Versus a black. One, two, three damage. So we'll take that. And that ends Gideon's turn. Recover five damage. So basically I have to do 13 damage in one Turn. Attack two different rebels. Target the healthy rebel that has suffered the least. Attack the healthy rebel that has suffered the least. Recover three. So. Seven, five. Gideon's the least. Uh, Fen. Uh, we'll start with Diala. That actually makes more sense. What do we have? Blue, red, yellow versus white. Six damage. That is... Diala is out. Okay, and he will then go after. That's sad. That's the first character I've lost in this game in a long, long time. Five versus seven, we'll go after Finn. Why are you gonna go after Finn is beyond me, but that's what the rules say. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Manages to hit. Manages to block. Takes three damage.
Okay. Finish. Verna is going to... Move one, two, three. And we'll look at this one, Shadow. She has... Oh, no, she's not. She is going to rest. Take a med pack. And that is the end of her turn. Self-destruct one minute. I'm in for a penny, in for a pound. Round 15. Verna will go on ahead and inspect. So we get this one. You have found one of the snipers. Really hoping for another mid pack, to be honest. Continue. Okay, she's gonna try her best. We're gonna try and take out Turbocharger. What's this? Play this card in your play area with your two strain tokens on it. While attacking, you may discard one strain token. Okay. Oh, I should have had that out a long time ago. Okay, shot grenade. Power gen. Discard this card to create token in your play while attacking. Apply a plus two and a pierce two to the. Oh, wow. And a create token in your play area. So since I don't have one, I can use it? I don't think so. Three adrenal strip. Okay. Okay, she is going to has to use the military blaster. So blue and yellow versus a black. And we're probably going, while attacking, you may discard one strain token from this card, apply a plus one to the attack result. So we're going to use this. So that gives us three. He misses one, but because I have three, I get a plus two. Plus a pierce of one, so that is three damage to number one. And that is the end of Verna's turn, and she is kind of toast. Assassin Droid. Attack Gideon. Okay, so the other one is going to, yeah, okay. And a red. Attacks the least amount of damage, which is going to be Verna. <sighs> we will take three. Oh, and she's no longer weakened. Plus one is four. OK, 
Okay, and the other one, attack Gideon. Move three to attack Gideon. Okay. So that's going to be one, two, three. One, two, three. Range of three. Oh, not good, not good, not good. Okay. One, two, three, four, five to Gideon. That gets him to nine. And second action is Attack Gideon. Gideon's out. Easily out. Gideon is defeated. Defeat. He had accuracy, never mind. Oh well. Okay. Finn. Is going to move one, two, three. One, two, three. Has three. We will apply the overcharger. Blue and a green. One, two, three. That takes this one out. So he is defeated. That is the end of Fen's turn. blown away by it. <sighs> Damn tank. Against Verna. Verna takes. Three damage only. Now fifth in. Okay, that's out. Two, three, four. And fence out. Okay. You realize your time is up and retreat from the facility. Hopefully she grabs everything on her way up. Um, you take the lift to the surface, get clear, waiting to see the base axe explode. When you hear the sound of another lift, Reaching the service, you are convinced the warnings were just a ruse to get you out of the facility. Continue. 
worried that someone is escaping with research you left behind. You are starting on your way to the other lift when the ground begins to rumble. A moment later, a ball of fire shoots out of the lift shaft you have taken to the surface. A concussive waves of the blast knocking you to the ground continue. By the time you get back to your feet and locate the other lift shaft, you have no trace of whoever had returned to the surface before the explosion. You think it's possible the lift had simply surfaced on its own, but you have a feeling you aren't that lucky. Continue. On the way back to the ship, you get a feeling that you are being followed. When you reach your ship without any sign of pursuers, you decide the feeling was simply paranoia from dealing with those assassin droids. I kind of agree. You put the feeling out of your mind as you board your ship and return to Haven. Well, we got some more stuff. Thank you for coming. Please make sure you like and subscribe. And we'll be back with Verna and a new squad next time. Thank you and I hope you have a really great day. Please like and subscribe.